we're generating a video about what it means to, to work for Outdoor Inc. You've gotten a job offer and, and they've told you, hey, you need to go watch this set of videos and this is the first one in the set. And this one basically is gonna cover the whole concept of being an employee at Outdoor Inc. and what the expectations are, what you get out of it, what everybody gets out of it. And you're talking to the horse's mouth. Uh, it's Matt Hamilton, he's the owner of, of the business and he's, and he's got opinions. I know you have opinions, he's got opinions. And this is his business and you're working for him. So it's important for you to know what he thinks about stuff and in particular you and your customers and, and why would you come to work for him in the first place and you know all of the above. Working for Outdoor Inc. Uh, to be successful in any business is a result of um, productivity and achieving quality standards. I created Outdoor Inc. to be a place where people who love operating equipment can come and have fun driving cool machines and using awesome tools and get paid to do it. In order for that to be possible, we've got to make money. In order to make money, we've got to provide very high quality services to customers who will pay us in order to be able to have fun operating big, fancy, fun equipment. We're building amazing environments for people who will pay us premium dollar so that we can afford to buy great equipment and men can love their jobs and all profit together as a result. A long time ago, I was talking to a friend of mine who was a uh, general contractor for a company called Ryan Homes in South Carolina. And he was telling me about his brick mason that he worked with. And the brick mason said his goal was to create a company where good men could work hard and be rewarded in proportion to their contribution. And I thought, I want to do that. And then also have the freedom to use their gifts artistically and functionally to create things without being micromanaged, which is the ultimate, um, which is the ultimate killer of creativity. I've got to be able to define what beautiful means or functional and then give them the tools to build it. The salesperson interprets the client's vision and then the project manager makes that a reality by building it in real time. So sales guys got to be able to articulate or draw an accurate interpretation of the vision, and then the sales project manager or, or the uh, the field project manager has got to be able to take that information and turn it into tangible real property. Once the vision's been established, then the field project manager and the sales project manager work together to create an action plan yeah. to make the vision a reality. So if you're coming to work for Outdoor Inc., you're being hired to do whatever it takes to get jobs done. 